Do you have here, here defenders or anything similar? You'll need them. I mean, the whole place will shake. The whole place will shake. The Rolls-Royce engine at its finest. It's quite a, it's quite a thing to behold. Gilda's just finishing her annual check. It's been in maintenance for four months. Today is the culmination of all of that work. The engine specifically, the whole of the top of it's been taken off and put back together again. So what we're going to do, roll the aeroplane out, start it, shut it down, check for leaks, and then back on the tie down for a full power run. In its current iteration, it's, it's capable of about 1,300 horsepower with 100 low lead avgas. Back in the war, they used up to 150 octane fuel, uh, which would have got 1,750 horsepower. We have to tie the back down so that the aeroplane doesn't tilt forward. And the last thing we want these to do is give way while we're doing this check, because the aeroplane will basically disintegrate with the brave mat inside. Yeah, get the engine run and make sure it all behaves. Hits all the numbers, don't have any leaks. Very heavy duty straps, and they're, they're strapped independently so that if either of those parts fail, the aeroplane still has a redundancy to stop it going over. These lines here, how many tons is rated? And they're five tons with that one strap. It's mad, isn't it? I mean, the whole place will shake. I've moved our aeroplanes out of the way because the amount of blast there will be and how far that blast will go. It's both enormously exhilarating and really, really frightening. Everything worked inside. There's nothing pouring out of it. Flying with passengers tomorrow. The guys have just finished panelling up, having done all the checks, and then we'll go and fly.